in the end, I guess there was no friends of AJ. Now it all makes sense. Bro, think about it. Nobody's a friend of AJ Styles, and we do what our boss told us to do, plain and simple. Am I right, bro? Company, he, can't go. he went on vacation. He turned his back on the entire company. Why would anybody go out there and save him anyway? Yeah, Plus, if he goes out there, I mean, you're gonna have to face there? us. Who pays us our money? Not AJ Styles. Who pays us our money, bro? So is this a changing of the guard, a new regime? We're out of the whole game with the new, uh, new faces. Who's younger, AJ Styles or Magnus? Dima, who's younger, AJ Styles uh, or Magnus? Magnus. Who's more jacked? Magnus. Who's better looking? Magnus. Boom. Hey, what's up? No, these guys are tag team champs. Those are our belts. You guys can hold them for a while. You know what happens when great minds think alike? That happens. Who said it on the A-team? I love it when a plan comes together. And did this plan come together? Get it not, boys. Come on, man. So in the end, so in the end, you should. You should. Maybe you'll learn something, kiddo. You feel me? It was just like we've said from the beginning. It was bad influence business. What you guys did for your reasons? I don't know. It's all right. We did this for bad influence. Hey, we did this hey, for ego. We did it for ego. We were out there before you guys were. Yeah. I mean, we made the jump before yeah, you know, When we got out there, you were getting your ass saved. No, we were losing it a lot. We had a right for a lot of We had a right for a lot of them. We had a right for a lot of them. It's only a matter of time. That ego turned the tide when the tide was right. Christopher Daniels, the ring general, the physical fascination breaking Gazarian, and most importantly, Bobby Roode, ego. When the tide needed to be turned, we were the ones that did it. You guys will get there, though. You guys will get there. Don't you fret. You keep working. We're, we're already there. We're, 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 we're the champions. What do we got to get, bro? We're the champions. Let's go. AJ, five bucks. It's been a pleasure. So, Your pleasure. We'll just cut that out, right? Notice how we, we, we went first, out. and they were the followers. So we set a precedent. Tell me about how you so. gave AJ the meaning of his life. What do you mean, AJ, to beat him with one? I mean, did you see it? Did you, I don't think that guy's gonna be able to ever walk again, bro. We're the welcoming committee. It was mainly because of us. It was a boot party. It was yeah. a boot party. It that was. deserves a boot. triple boom, actually. Boom! boom. Party. Mr. Hebner, I mean, it seemed like you were in an extremely tough spot out there having to call the match as a referee. It was no disqualifications. You seemed extremely conflicted out there in doing the right thing and doing your job. Tell me about that. It's it's ridiculous when you have a championship match, two titles on the line, and you have all these people out there interfering. Even if it's no disqualification, it's ridiculous. And I got sick of it, and I got tired of it, and I left. I left them all out there to do what they want. Tell me about the moment that you put hands on Spot. Had you had enough? I'd had enough. Uh, I'd had enough from all of them. And he would tip the iceberg when I came out. I was, I was pissed, I was mad, and it didn't matter. Could have been anybody. I'd have knocked him down if I was, if I could have. It seems like you have a part of history of people screwing people. Tell me about the screw that happened tonight. It's one of the. Uh, it's horrible. I've been there. I've seen those, and this is ridiculous the way it was done. There's no reason for a match to have to go like this and end like this. And someday it's all going to come back on Magnus and Dixon. You're saying thank you, AJ. Tell me what that means. That means AJ was a hell of a champion, and he got screwed big time, big time, and it's ridiculous. He didn't get beat, he got screwed out of the title, as far as I'm concerned. It seemed like your, your son, Brian Hebner, I saw a, a moment and a glance between the two of you. What, if you could have said anything to him out there at that moment or done anything, what would that be? I said, get back where you came from. Don't go down there. But Dixie overruled that. And now I'm, she's threatening to fire me. And maybe I'm already fired. I don't know. But I'll know next week. Seemed like the right thing to do and the risk to take? Yeah. For me, yeah. I've been there. I've seen everything. And for me, if she wants to fire me, she'll have to fire me. Because I can't put up with stuff like that anymore.